so. So we're getting our first blind goat. That should be interesting. Yeah, that will be interesting. Today is a special day. My idol, Gene Bauer, is coming to Barn Sanctuary, and I want to make sure it's perfect. It's really great to work with Farm Sanctuary. They're the prime model that I built Barn Sanctuary around. Gene started the first ever farm animal sanctuary in the country. He's rescued thousands of animals, and today he's going to be rehoming one of them here at Barn Sanctuary. Oh, look at the cute piggy. Oh my gosh, that's so cool. What's up? Hi. Hey, How's Dan, it going? How you doing? Great yeah, to it's see been you, a man. while. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> so good to see you. Farm Sanctuary started in 1986, and we currently care for about 1,000 animals at our farms in upstate New York and in Acton, California, just outside of Los Angeles. Welcome to the farm. OK, so this is our interspecies pasture. Either we call it the kid barn or the goat barn. And it's beautiful to see what you're doing here. I met Dan at an animal rights conference. And we just ran into each other and connected right away. He had such a positive uh, vibe about him. This is Jim and Jill and they're soy sheep. Hello. <laughs> Gene's work at Farm Sanctuary and his passion for farm animals has really inspired me. I was reading one of Gene's books when my dad called me and was wondering what we should do with the family farm. And then it hit me. I think I wanted to start a farm sanctuary. It's like a dream for you to be here. Oh, it's a dream for me too, man. And yeah. it's exciting to be here and to see what has happened. Yeah. You know? It's a win-win. It's a beautiful totally. thing. Here comes Charlie. Oh. Come here, buddy. Come here, oh, little man. He's adorable. Oh, oh hi, gosh. buddy. <laughs> oh. Hi. Hi. Where am I? And he's it's a also, long road trip here. He's a board. He's also goat. unable to see. Yeah. It's just the way he was born. We have a couple of blind animals, so okay. they get around just great. Aw, so cute. Charlie's adorable. So what's this uh, boy's story? He came to us through a woman who had rescued him in Kentucky, but unfortunately was not able to provide him the care he needed because he's just blind. He was born that way. And then it just worked out that yeah. you guys were ready to take him. That's perfect. <laughs> he's he in a place healthy. where he's going to be loved, yes. going to enjoy life. Just like Farm Sanctuary. Yes, yes. that's yes. what it's about, right? Y'all just have a few more animals than us right now. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, it's just so amazing, because you guys have been around for so long. and Been at it a lot longer, oh, but yeah. what you guys are doing here is beautiful. Thank you, yeah. Hey, bye. He's happy in his new home. Yeah. Which is great. Bye, buddy. Live long and prosper. <laughs> we need to find a place for KJ to live so Ginger can finally have some peace. Luckily, KJ is ready to leave quarantine, so we're going to introduce her to our other Nigerian dwarf goats, Ellen, Twitch, and Portia. Come on, KJ! Oh, oh little lady. Oh. oh, my gosh. Ready? She's wild. Yeah, play nice. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Come on, KJ! Come on! Go! Oh, Ellen sees oh. her. going to be the first. Come say hi. You know, you guys can play, too. I know you're older and you want to be cool, but oh, go play. Oh. <laughs> this is very exciting. Yeah. What happens when we leave? I know. That's my question. Yes. Let's see what happens when we uh, vacate the area. Okay. We're going to okay. leave KJ alone? No. Maybe they'll befriend her. All right, vacate the area. We love you. Mom will be back. <laughs> It'll be OK. Look how scared she is. Oh, oh. No, 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 not happening. Ellen. Oh. Not a good idea, man. That's a bad idea. Ellen, oh, crap. That's the bully kid at school, especially with her well, Given leg, her leg. We don't want it to get all jacked up. Ah. Hey. <gasps> that's yeah, not right, cool. much. That's Done. Stop it, not stop cool. it, let her go. Not cool. Ellen, why? Because she's being a punk. She grew up to be a bully. Headbutting head to head with goats is fine. It means that they're playing. But head to body means that they're trying to show their dominance. I think Ellen's just trying to show KJ who's boss. You know, when she's older, she'll be able to fight back. But right now, she's young. She's too little. All right, yeah. guys. Yeah, maybe just Portia and Twitch, not Ellen. We can kick Ellen out and try it. So I'm going to get Ellen out of the pen to see if KJ can hang with Portia and Twitch. They're only about a year apart. Ellen? Nope.
<gasps> Portia! 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 Come here! I'm so surprised at you. So obviously, this isn't gonna work right now. KJ's just not big enough to defend herself right now, and because her leg is just healed, we don't want her to re-injure it. Aww. It's because KJ's too cute. <laughs> She's jealous. It's all jealousy. Well, we were hoping to find a new roommate for KJ today, but back to the drawing board. KJ, come on. Good girl. Jay, what are you doing? Guess what? You are getting a new roommate today. Mm-hmm. You guys are gonna be lifelong friends. We picked him out specifically for you. At Barn Sanctuary, we believe that all animals benefit from the buddy system. But KJ is too crazy to be in there with Ginger, but she's too small to go out with the other Nigerian dwarf goats. <gasps> Portia! Portia! Come here! but we think we've come up with the solution. Charlie, our goat from Farm Sanctuary, will be the perfect roommate for KJ. He's blind and very gentle, but he's big enough that KJ can't jump all over him. Ready? Come on. Come on. It's gonna be lots of fun. You're walking pretty straight right now, I'm happy. No circles. Today's a huge day. Charlie is finally leaving the quarantine space and gonna be living with Kelly Jr. and the goat barn in their own little area, as well as they're gonna have their own little goat playground. All your friends are over here. They don't know you're coming yet. Yeah, I don't know why I'm pointing, because you can't see. <laughs> I fully believe Charlie's gonna get along with KJ. It's more of, is KJ gonna get along with Charlie? You never know what can happen. So we'll see how this goes. KJ, Charlie. Charlie, KJ. Oh, whoa. Whoa. KJ! <laughs> Very excited to see each other. Hi, Charlie! That he's doing so good. Yeah, I think this is a much better fit, because when she was with Ginger, she was jumping all over her. <laughs> Ginger's down all the time. So I think Charlie is very gentle and... Bigger. Yeah, bigger, and KJ can't jump on him. Yeah. So this will be much better for both of them. Can we go let them out on the playground? I would like now? to. I think they like each other. Um. Charlie really can't see, so he kind of is his own little world, but um, it, did, it didn't go horribly.